Hello, everyone. Um, today, I'm going to introduce you to my another team member, and he's been a blessing to not only to me, to many others. Uh, hello, Brother Ritesh. How are you doing? Hello, sister. I'm doing good. Thank you for receiving, receiving me today. You're most welcome. Today, I'm going to discuss a little bit more about our uh, his contribution in Hannah's dream and our relationship and a little bit about what we are doing for the kingdom of God, the talents and skills which God has given us. And as you know, that Hannah's dream is almost going to celebrate one year and we are all very excited and we are very passionate about. So Ritesh, tell me something about yourself. Uh, my name is Ritesh Kanya, and I'm currently living in Surrey, BC, Canada. And um, I'm in the IT industry uh, for the last 15 years plus. And my education is in computer science. That's a little bit, you know, about uh, my background currently. That's wonderful. I'm very blessed to have you uh, on this project. And I'm really, really thankful for your talents and give which God has given you. Tell us something about uh, how we met and what you have contributed towards uh, this project. So the way we met in 2017, God uh, put in my heart uh, to move to Surrey, BC from uh, Montreal. And I didn't know what was, you know, waiting for me. So I listened to his voice and I moved to Surrey, BC on the other continent. And then from the church, I met with uh, Sister Hannah's and family. And from there, we start uh, uh, sharing our testimony. And uh, Sister Hannah was sharing about her dream she had from, from God about a persecuted church. And this is how the story began uh, in 2017 for us. As Brother Ritesh said that I was sharing my testimony and you all know I love to share testimonies. Wherever I get chance, I do share. Thank God for that. Um, the dream is uh, this uh, September 19, 2013, when I met uh, Brother Ritesh, I found that he's also passionate about uh, doing some work towards kingdom of God. And he's also passionate about, uh, uh, he's also blessed with dreams and God has been using him mightily in different areas. So we just talk and share. And then we said, um, let's let's do something. And then uh, he's been helping me with a lot of IT. Tell us how you're helping me, brother. So as you know, you know, in the IT industry, we are very, very busy. And, uh, you know, sometimes we have to, I have to work uh, after work hour, uh, receiving calls, uh, could be in the midnight, you know, and either early in the morning after work. But, you know, uh, when I, you know, uh, listen to the uh, to the story so and and then God put on my heart you know to to start uh, working uh, with uh, sister Hannah especially you know because when we start we need to know uh, about us let people to know about us you know one of the way we need to build a platform set up a platform and I I start working on the website, uh, creating awareness and also doing multimedia. This is how actually uh, I start uh, uh, working with uh, Sister Hannah on her projects on Hannah's dreams. Thank you so much for doing that. And he did voluntary that uh, website. Um, to be honest with you, he was just sitting one day Sunday and he just said today I have to finish this within no time he just prepared the website he created all the pages and within no time before he leave around 10 o'clock in the night that day he finished all the website and he was traveling he was leaving um, 
for some other place for some work and he said before i go i want to finish this so all day we were sitting and planning and finishing the website so when people see they might see something there so thank you so much for doing that brother i really really honor and i'm blessed to have you on the board uh ritesh is also one of our uh, team member now he is officially entitled for this position and i always honor his work his time his passion for the persecuted church would you like to say something to the audience uh you know uh we are this stream is uh, based on the persecuted church you know when we look at the bible itself jesus himself was persecuted by his own and also his disciple and jesus himself you know established a church the church is the body of christ and we are the church and you know when the body of christ we are the representation of Jesus on this earth. If there is no church on the earth, you know, this world will be totally different. So, uh, you know, the reason why, you know, I'm here to support uh, this project because we want, I want to, you know, um, create this awareness to the Christian families that you know, when our brothers and sister are persecuted, you know, it's very important for us to stand up, stand with them and support them in any area we can. It could be through prayers or through support, physical supports, or like me, what I'm doing, I use uh, the skills God gave me, you know, in IT to build, to do whatever I can, you know, to create the platform for communication. And I believe uh, in God, in Christ's bodies, there is a lot of person with great talent that can come and help us, you know, to make these dreams come true through a movie, because to do a movie is very challenging and times. Uh, like the like the sisters just said, it's been already one year we are working and we need a lot of help. We need a lot of support because without you, we cannot achieve this, uh, this goal. And uh, because, uh, you know, for persecuted, we need to stand with them, stand together with us. And together we will be very strong for God's. Where? That's true. You're you're hundred percent right. I agree with you, because Bible says, "When I was hungry, thirsty, or naked, and in the jail, you did not come and visit me." So when there was a time come, and you're standing in the row, he will also deny in front of his father and say, "I don't know you." So it's a very scary uh, part when we read that verse, Matthew. It says, uh, "I I get scared because I'm not doing anything." For my people on the earth then how can i expect god to accept me and how to expect good rewards so as a good servant it is our responsibility it is our um, very very important role on the earth that we help our brothers and sisters in christ as well as especially those who are persecuted and today we both and we whole team request all of you whoever is watching this video please come forward if you have any talent you think you can contribute a little bit every week or day or hour that would be appreciated we are looking for producer director we are also looking for finances because if you can contribute one coffee or one mcdonald maybe that can save somebody's life where people are persecuted so please come forward and please help us doing this job this is not about me anymore. It's not about my dream. It's more about Christians, more about persecution, more about women and children, which we are trying to make this movie and create the awareness. So thank you, brother, so much for your time. I really appreciate all what you have done till today. And thank you for being a part of Hannah's dream. And we are excited to celebrate in September, our first uh, year of uh, Hannah's dream. Thank you so much for everything. 
So thank you so much, uh, sister, for give, giving me this opportunity to be part of this project. And, you know, uh, there is no better than, you know, doing the work of God, Jesus Christ, in this, in this current uh, uh, situation we are going through in this world. So, and I believe, you know, we have, um, we will have a great success in, through Christ in, in the future, in the name of Jesus. So Amen. I want to thank you so much. Thank you. Thank, Thank you, you, everyone. Bye for now. Thank you, everyone. Bye-bye.